Yo, what is up guys? Isaac Buck Barfield back with another non-alcoholic beer review. And today I have another athletic brewing company. We have the Run Wild Non-Alcoholic IPA. And what is this? A real glass? I have the Teku um, stemmed glass here. Um, supposed to improve the flavor of your brews, and let me tell you, it does. 100%. This glass is gorgeous, too. Oh my goodness. I just, I, I look and I feel like my pinky should be up when I'm drinking from this glass here. 14 and a half ounces. Um, not quite a pint, which is 16, of course, but what you gonna do? It's beautiful. So, I'm all for it. Um, so, here we are, Athletic Brew Co. Run Wild Non-Alcoholic IPA. Um, any words here? No, not really. Not really any words. Brewed in the USA. Certified Organic by Bay State Organic Certified. So that's cool. Um, water, barley, organic Vienna malt, hops, yeast. So maybe not all organic. Maybe it is. It's oh, it just says made with organic malt. So just organic malt there. But that's okay. That is okay. So let's crack this baby open. Of course, as always, this baby has been sitting for about 10, 15 minutes, warming up, because my fridge is way too cold. Got to bring the temp up to around 45 to really bring out the flavors of the brew. Look at that. Perfect pour. Perfect pour. Now, let me tell you about this, this glass here. Let me tell you about this glass here. Well, first, first, let's talk about this brew. Look at that. Look at the head on that. Perfect pour. Perfectly, you know, perfect size glass there. Oh my goodness. That is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Ugh. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. I'm about to get foam in my face. Who cares? Oh, not really. The way this glass is shaped here, you don't really get any uh anything in your face. One second. Dudes! Get out of here. Okay, and then they're gonna come. Alright, alright, cool. Ignoring y'all. Ignoring y'all. Hmm. All right. The nose on this brew. Put our can back here so we see what we're drinking. Run Wild Athletic Brew Co. Run Wild IPA. And let me tell you, it is a wild one. This is delicious. You know, fruity, hoppy, malty nose on this. You get a nice malt background and the flavor. Background, backbone and the flavor. Um, great color on this, man. This is this is probably the most gorgeous brew from, from Athletic Brew Co., in my opinion. Oh, man. Mmm. Oh, a little foam stash going on there. Oh, yeah, that's what I like to see. Of course, repping Carolina. I went there for three years. Did not graduate, but, you know, not all, not all of us are meant to graduate. Uh, that is one common misconception in society today. You do not have to graduate college to be successful. Um, being successful is all about your attitude, your mindset, and how hard you're willing to work. Mmm. This brew is amazing. Oh my goodness. Oh, I don't even have my pee me up here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Indubitably. Indubitably. Oh, my, yes, Saya. This is a multi, a multi hoppy beverage. Oh, man. I just feel like, I don't know. I just feel like that's the accent I should have when, when drinking from this. But. Reasons why I love this glass, it's stemmed. 
So the brew is not making my hand cold, nor is my warm hand making the brew warm. Um, so how, how I like to use this glass and, and why this glass works is, is because of, of the shape of it here. Um, so basically when, when you go to drink the brew, the, the lip of, of the glass here, all that, all those terpenes coming out of the brew are just being funneled straight into your nasal cavities. So when, I, when I'm really wanting to try a brew, give it a little swirl here like a, like a fine wine. And then when I go to drink, I'm gonna breathe in through my nose up until the brew comes to my mouth. Breathing in, breathing in, breathing in until I swallow. I obviously can't swallow and breathe in at the same time. Swallow and then exhale. So here we go, swirl, swirl, swirl. And let me tell you, any brew you're drinking, no matter what it is, that right there is gonna give you the best flavor experience. Because flavor, flavor actually isn't completely just in the taste buds. So much of flavor of, our, of, of everything has to do with our olfactory senses, with our noses. And so this, this glass really helps that, that olfactory uh, you know, process so you're getting this, the smell of it while you're also getting the flavor of it. And it really just improves the flavor of any brew or beverage for, for that matter. Um, you know, you, you could put wine in here, you could put whatever. Um, me up in non-alcoholic brews, it really, 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 really brings out the flavor of them. Oh man, it's it's really really it really an experience with with this glass. I, oh man, I love this thing. Never, never in my life have I gotten a a nice official you know craft beer glass, which you know I yeah, I really should have a long time ago. But you, you you just you don't think about it. You don't think about it. Perfect pairing right here. Run Wild IPA, Athletic Brew Co. The Teku glass. This is amazing. Oh man. Oh, this is this is great. Oh sudsy, foamy, just like we want to see at the end. Oh yeah. Oh man. Oh ladies and gentlemen. Alright. That was wonderful. Uh, I approve of that brew, 100%. Um, Y'all know me, I'm an IPA guy, and that really hit the spot there. Um, they do not tell us what kind of hops it has, but that's okay. Uh, coming up next, though, is the All Out, which is a stout. Not really a stout guy, but <clears throat> it's beer, and I love beer. So we will be back. Isaac Buck Barfield, out.